wait a minute now. Tricks popcorn? What the world? It's like two shades of green. Babes, y'all doing all right over here? How's y'all doing? Your girl is back and ready to drop another video for y'all on today. I just got up probably about maybe three hours ago. It's going on 11.30. So I'm making like perfect timing right now, y'all. I got a couple of stores I gotta go in today. I gotta run some errands, pick up some stuff. I'm just sitting here real quick eating, eating my little lunch. I got some broccoli, cauliflower, some cheese, and then I got some neck bones over here. <laughs> so your girl cooked some neck bones, y'all. I had um, green beans and a ziti. I cooked that a week ago. Was it a week ago? Yeah, I cooked that a week ago for Jemiah and Lewis to have something to eat. And I made me some broccoli and cauliflower and cheese. Y'all know your girl got to get right back on her little diet due to her eating all of that stuff. Child, I told some stuff up on that boat. I told some stuff up on that boat. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, I'm gonna get back with it, y'all. I ain't gonna be doing too much eating. I'm gonna get back to my little my little routine of eating healthy and not eating so much okay but anyways um i'm going in sam's walk i'm not going to be walmart i'm gonna do sam's walmart probably the dollar tree um i think that's gonna be it yeah that may just be all the stores that i'm going in today y'all because i got the grab a lot of household items that I am running low on. I went in my laundry room closet. I went in my my hallway closet. Girl, I was just everywhere looking and seeing what I need so I won't miss nothing while I'm at the store. I did make me a little list of things so that I won't forget nothing because every time I'm in the store, child, I'm always forgetting something. But yeah, that's what I got on my agenda for today. I got a review that I'm going to throw into this vlog y'all so y'all just stay tuned for that but your girl finna eat real quick and head out y'all so y'all gonna catch me you know out here in these streets okay so i'm headed to the dollar tree first y'all okay let me find my little thing so i can sit y'all a little i can't go to dollar general though because you know they got dollar items up in there too and I forgot all about the Dollar General, y'all know. We be sleeping on Dollar General sometimes, child. And I remember going back, telling y'all that they had a dollar uh, a dollar rack. And that's somewhat what I may end up doing. I may go to the, to the uh, Dollar General real quick. And then I'm going to hit up Dollar Tree, y'all. Yeah, let me go on down here to this Dollar General real quick, y'all. I'm gonna see what they got on their little dollar app. Cause you know, I can pick all my little dollar dollar uh stuff up over there versus dollar twenty-five stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna make my way out here first. I'm trying to find the dollar out real quick. Let's see. They got stuff to here up here too. Okay. I, it looks like they can change some stuff around at this Dollar General, girl. I think they have because stuff ain't in the same place no more. But here's their dollar, dollar deals right here, y'all. All right here, so I'm just gonna pick up what I need. All right, let's see, let's see. Okay, so I don't see any cotton balls over here. Matter of fact, I'm gonna go over there. Um, 
where the nails and stuff is, and I'm gonna see if they got some over there for a dollar. I'm shocked they don't have any hand soap over here. I see shampoo and deodorant. They got a little toothpaste over here. Not much, but I may want to grab some of this right here for a dollar instead of getting it at, um, at Dollar Tree. Yeah, I'll just grab some of these. This one look like it's messed up. I'm gonna grab two of these and two of these right here. Yeah. I'm shocked though they don't have no cotton balls over here. But like I said, I'm gonna go over there and look and see. They hand soap normally would be somewhere in this area because i remember them selling that clorox hand soap y'all i don't see none of that girl i don't see not a one at all mm -hmm. i'm gonna make these little cups hmm. what is this right here it's a super eraser Oh, this is for to get Mars and stuff off the wall and stuff like this, y'all. I think I had one of these, but I had the uh, Mr. Clean one, and I was using it to clean my sink out with it. And you know all the little rust and stuff? Those actually work getting the rust out your sink. I don't know how this one worked due to it being a dollar. It may work the same, but I don't know. What is this? These are like Glade, Heavy Duty. What is that? Fork? These are forks. Yeah, I may need to pick up some of this aluminum foil right here, too. I'm going to grab two more of these. Because y'all know Thanksgiving around the corner, baby. Y'all better get y'all pans, y'all aluminum foil, y'all plastic spoons and forks. Y'all better rack up right now because I'm going to tell y'all, when November hit, which, girl, it's just in a couple of days. Well, I don't know when y'all get this video. Y'all may just get this video. <laughs> Like, in the beginning of November, I don't know when it's going to be uploaded, but I'm just saying, y'all need to hurry up and grab y'all Thanksgiving food items and y'all stuff that y'all going to be using to cook y'all food with, paper plates, you know, uh, plastic forks, whatever y'all get on Thanksgiving, y'all need to grab it right now. Because Candy Poo is grabbing her stuff right now. I've already grabbed like a couple of pans, y'all, when I was at the Dollar Tree the other day. I did pick some pans up because I was just like, these pans are not going to be here. Not in November. These jokers going to be gone. <laughs> so I grabbed like four of them, I believe. Maybe four or five pans, y'all. Because I ain't cooking a whole lot. But your girl do want some chitlins, though. I need some chitlins in my life, y'all. A lot of y'all probably don't eat that. But girl, I ain't had no chitlins in so long. I want some chitlins, some dressing. Maybe do just a little bit of yams. I'm kind of like tired of macaroni. I want something else besides macaroni, child. I don't know. I have to think of something. And I just cooked the ziti, so I know I ain't gonna do that. I may do some, some spaghetti or something like that. That's what I may do. But however, child, y'all better grab y'all stuff while, while it's out now. Let me finish getting what I need. What is this right here? Oh, this is the, I may grab one of these. I know they sell these at the Dollar Tree, y'all, but I don't think it's the same brand, though. I think it's two different brands. I'm going to try one of them. Let me see if they got any more down here. Oh, here it is, child. So this must be like a different off-brand, because this is the one that they sell at the Dollar Tree, I think. So I believe I'm going to grab two of these right here, because... I pour these here in my uh, toilet bowls, and it makes the toilet bowl smell good. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna grab two of those, and I think I'm gonna get away from over here now, child. Let me go and walk over there and see if I can find me some uh, some cotton balls real quick. So I ran across this little aisle right here, y'all, and I see a lot of different stuff on this rack. They got this coming here for 
a dollar. This is like kitchen cleaner. I'm gonna grab one of these and see how it works. Which I ain't never used no Comet kitchen cleaner before, y'all. But uh, I'm gonna grab one since it's a dollar. It's just got different prices over here, really. So let me walk on down here. I'm trying to figure out where is they. Um, well, actually, I'm gonna let y'all see they see they quick, you know, home decor over here. They got some clocks, a couple of lamps, picture frames, and stuff like that. This is like wall, like shelves and stuff, and rugs, and a lot of different candles. I know they, they, um, cosmetic items are up here in the front, so I'm gonna head up here. I need to go over there down, down on a food aisle too, cause Jemiah, she texts me some type of noodles that she asking me for. I'm gonna see if they got them in here. Cause I know I got to go to Walmart, but I'm gonna check in here first. Cause them some strange kind of noodles she looking for, child. Let me see if I can find some cotton balls. and this is like a 12 count so let me ask y'all a question is this cheaper in here than it is in walmart girl because i really don't even know to be honest with y'all <laughs> i really really do not know i don't know i do see their hand soap up here though so they got it over here for a dollar 35 so it's not a dollar nowhere mm. but however let me go on over here to this food section because the girl can't find no cotton balls, but I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to think about getting this soap, though, because I'm trying to think. Is it cheaper? Like, um, at Walmart? I don't know. Oh, y'all know what? I had to stop down to Christmas. Girl, ah, look at all these cute little ornaments. And y'all, that ain't nothing but a dollar, baby. And these actually look better than the Dollar Tree ornaments. Well, I'm going to say... They almost like the same, almost. They're just a dollar in here versus the dollar 25 store. You can come up in here and get them cheaper. Yes, well all this little stuff right here a dollar. This is a dollar. These little reindeer ears are a dollar. They got Christmas bows and stuff for a dollar, y'all. All this stuff here is for a dollar. Look at these cute little ornaments, y'all. So cute. Mmm. Well, let me make my way. This is all of their fall stuff right here, y'all. I like this little bliss sign. It's cute. But yeah, they got all their little fall stuff over here. Which ain't too high. Very affordable prices. Yeah, I like that little wreath too. We got some real nice stuff up in here, child. Like I said, y'all, we be sleeping on the Dollar General now. <laughs> okay, so let me walk down here real quick so I can get up out of here. Let me go down they food. They food aisle. I'm gonna have to try to find these noodles, child. Jamaya had texted me <laughs> some food items that she wanted me to pick up while I was uh shopping in these stores today. Okay. Hold on, y'all. Let me get my phone, girl. All right, y'all. So, these are the noodles right here that she asked me to get for her. So, I'm going to have to try to find these up in here. If not, they may sell them at Walmart. Yeah, and then, what does she got on here? These little drinks right here, where well, they like juices. Those what she normally pick up. But I told her, I'm not buying those. Because she asked me for some of them other big size juices. I said, you're going to either get the little small ones or the big ones. Which one you want? She said, I'll take the big one. So, girl, I ain't buying them little bit of juices. Not this time, I'm not. Wait a minute, is this it? This is it. But I don't think this is the right. Let me look at my phone one more time. I don't think that's the right flavor she was asking me for. Because this got 
this got on it. This got garlic, garlic chicken. Let me look at my phone again real quick to see which flavor she want. Oh, that is the flavor she want, child. Look at y'all. Garlic chicken. I probably can't see it, but it says garlic chicken, so this is the one she asked me for. So I'm gonna grab this one. I only see one. I all the rest of it. So I'm gonna grab this right here. <sighs> okay, so here goes some more. What the flavor is this? This is teriyaki beef. Okay, so here's another chicken. I'm gonna get her like two of them because she ain't never had them before, child. So she may not even like it. How much them things cost? They're a dollar thirty-five. So, how are y'all? Let me get up out of here. So I'm headed to the Dollar Tree next. Ooh. Okay, y'all. I was trying to find my little security trying to find my little list so I can check out everything that I just picked up at, at the Dollar General. Making sure. This camera kind of dark. Okay, y'all. Listen, I got my little list right here so I won't forget nothing. Y'all know I be up in these stores and I'm always forgetting something. Okay, so I got my toothpaste. I got my uh oh y'all I should have picked up some easy off up in here but I'll grab it at Walmart. <sighs> that's the only thing that's on here that I picked up. I got bathroom cleaner on here. I couldn't find no cotton balls, but I'm gonna get my bathroom cleaner from Walmart because I like to grab those. Um I like to pick up the ones with the Clorox in it. And I'll just pick some up when I'm at the Wally World. But anyways, chat, I'm headed out here to, to the Dollar Tree real quick. And then I'm going to make my way. Um, I need to go this way. I'm going to make my way to Walmart and Sam's. Yeah, Sam's. I'm trying to figure out, do I even want to go to Sam's today, y'all? Because I wasn't going up in there. Uh, for a whole lot I was just picking up some paper plates and I don't think I need nothing else because I have I have enough paper towels at the moment and I got enough well I can get another thing of toilet paper you know just to be stocked up yeah I can but I'll see child I'm on my way to this Dollar Tree So I'm right here with a cotton ball is it. I'm gonna grab like two of these. Okay, let's see. I ain't gonna be in here long, sure. I know I'm not. I'm just gonna try to hear up and grab what I need. So I won't be wasting a whole lot of time. I don't think I need nothing from right here. I don't think I do. Oh, I may need to grab me some of these personal pads right here. This like mm -hmm, mm -hmm. this says sure and fresh. I'm trying to see this. Okay, it says none sent it. I want to grab me two of these. Okay, so I'm gonna walk down here. I know I need some fabuloso, y'all. Yeah, hopefully they got some. Okay. I see the Ajax. But I do not see. Oh, okay. I see. I was looking for the one that had more in it. Because they normally sell like the taller uh sizes but i don't see them in here now child it look like everybody didn't wrecked up on them 
So this is what I was talking about right here, y'all. Y'all see this? Same stuff I just picked up at um, Dollar General. This one just have more in it. Yeah, this is just a taller bottle. And it's a dollar twenty-five in here. Versus I just paid a dollar for mine. So I guess I'm gonna have to grab some of these uh fabulosos. Let me walk down here just to make sure I don't see any any uh larger sizes in it, which I don't. I don't think I need no dishwashing liquid or nothing like that. I have plenty of that racked up in the closet, child. Okay, so let me go ahead and grab. I guess I'm gonna get two of these right here. Two of those. And let's see. I wish they had two of these blue ones. I only see one though. Mm, I did uh, try one of these y'all and it actually smells pretty good it does but I don't want this kind I actually want this kind I'll grab one of these just so Jamaya can use these to clean up her restaurant with sometimes I be mopping with them too y'all but <laughs> I be um pouring a little bit of that in my mop bowl just to make the house smell good when you're mopping but you know i normally use that mr clean this smell pretty good too okay so let me walk down here i'm trying to figure out what else do i need from out of here do i need anything else i don't think i do hmm I don't think I do, y'all. I am gonna walk over here though to see if they got some some heavy duty forks for me. These are the ones that I normally buy anyway. I'm gonna grab two of these. I don't see no spoons. Well, I was looking for ooh, what am I kicking, child? Let me get this up. I don't see no super heavy duty spoons. I do see these, and these are a little bit small. I normally buy the heavy duty spoons and forks, but looks like they out of the spoons. So I'll just have to pass on that. All right, uh -huh. So yeah, these are their uh, ornaments. Really, really pretty, y'all so cute but like i said y'all dollar general i feel like they got some real cute ones and i think the dollar tree though now that i'm here looking at them these actually look look a little better because i don't even think dollar general had these styles right here these are really cute these are very cute right here so what in the world do i hear <laughs> Yeah, these are all cute right here. So cute. Wait a minute, y'all. This right here goes with my uh my Christmas decor that I had a year ago. I can't even get that down. But that's the same type of uh what y'all call that black and white checkerboard? I think it's McKenzie. It's something, girl. Start with an M. I can't even remember, child. Well, those will be cute on my Christmas tree, but I'm not putting up a Christmas tree this year. <sighs> Due to everything being packed up in boxes and my living room is looking the way it's looking, child. There will be no Christmas tree up in my house this year. Sorry about that, because I know a lot of y'all on my vlog channel like to see me decorating and stuff like that. Well, baby, I got too much going on in, in, in my living room, and I ain't got nowhere to sit no Christmas tree. Not this year, I don't, so I will not be putting up my Christmas tree. Jamaya, she just asked me for a lot of different stuff. She already sent me her Christmas list, so I'm just going to start getting some of her stuff, and 
I may just wrap all her gifts. I'm gonna sit them in the living room, but she will not have a tree. <laughs> she will not have a Christmas tree this year. It's just nowhere for me to put it. And the way, like I said, the way my living room looking right now, child. <gasps> Candy Pooh thought she was gonna be gone out of town somewhere. But God turned us all the way around and we got to wait on the Lord. So, I hate everything happened the way it happened. But I can't rush God. So, <sighs> sorry about that, y'all. <sighs> okay, let me go around here real quick. See if I need anything else. So, y'all, this is all I need. I'm finna get ready to check out. Uh huh, I'm finna come around there. Uh oh. oh she yeah, I'm gonna come around. That's fine. Sorry, I didn't see. It's okay. Come around here. So, God, I didn't see nothing else that I needed or nothing like this. So, I'm just gonna stick with this right here. And I'm gonna get up out of here, child. Okay. All right, y'all. It's a Kroger across the street. Since I'm over here, I might as well go on over there real quick and pick up just a couple of food items that um, Jemiah asked me for. Whew. I was finna go to... um. Well, you know what? I actually can pick up everything when I get to Walmart. Like, everything that I need. Yeah, that's probably what I do, because I don't want to be making all these stops. But, yeah, y'all. Let me just, girl, let me <laughs> let me compare prices real quick. This is something that I need to check out, baby. The Dollar General versus the Dollar 25 tree. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so at Dollar General, my total came out to $12.76 for, let's see. Oh. Y'all, listen. Hold on. Okay, now I see how she rung this up. Because I see $2 on everything. And I'm like, how is everything $2 when everything's supposed to be a dollar? But I see that she put how many items that I got and she rung it up like that. Okay. Okay, now I see what's going on. So $12.76 for two, four, six, eight. Eleven for eleven items. Okay, I just picked up one, six, seven, eight, nine, ten items at the Dollar Tree, the Dollar Twenty Five Tree. My total came out to thirteen dollars and seventy two cents. So I'm off by a dollar and some change, y'all. And I believe I picked up more items at the Dollar Tree versus the Dollar General. Which I did. No, I didn't. I got 10 items. 10 items and 11 items at the Dollar General. I paid a dollar. So it was just a dollar over at Dollar Tree versus Dollar General, y'all. And I picked up what less items less items at dollar general versus the dollar tree or did i say i picked up more girl i don't know i'm confusing myself but anyways i was just trying to compare pricing just to see who was going to be the cheapest and it looks like i was just a dollar off that's all i was just a dollar and some change less from shopping up here at the dollar tree it's okay though it's okay 
But you know when you when you see a deal, you better grab it and you better pick it up. Why is there? <laughs> I'm just saying, child. I'm just saying. I think I'm gonna go and go to Sam's real quick and pick up some paper plates, y'all. That's what I think I'm gonna do. Or yeah, I'm gonna go and go to Sam's right quick, y'all. Then I'm gonna hit up uh Walmart. All right, y'all. So let's get into this quick sneaker review, really, really quick, y'all. So this video is in collaboration with McKicks.ru. Now, this is the same company, y'all, that sent out another pair of kicks that I reviewed for y'all. I think that was a couple of weeks ago. So they were so kind to send me out another pair, but Jemiah went on the site this time and picked her out some kicks. And she got some Nikes. She did get these in a size six and a half. I don't know why this box has an eight on it, but this is a six and a half, y'all, which is a 37.5 in the European sizes, which is a 39. Okay, wait a minute. So these are called the Nike Dunk Low Retro um, Apple Greens. Okay. So this is what the kicks are looking like, y'all. Bam! <laughs> All right, wait a minute, wait a minute. Got a little card in here. Okay, so they also sent me out their website, IG, WhatsApp, and I do have a code for y'all that I will be mentioning as soon as I get through doing a complete review of these kicks. Okay, so bam! <laughs> this is what Jemiah is rocking, y'all. These are really cute. I'm liking this color though. This color is really nice. Yes, this is a pretty apple green though, y'all. It's like two shades of green. We got a dark color green here, and then it goes lighter here. And on the toe part, we have that white Nike check with the white laces. These did not come with another pair of laces though. So yeah, even though they don't really need a, another color laces, y'all, I think white goes perfectly fine with this, this pretty apple green. This is the outer sole. Okay, let's jump right into the inside really quick. This is what the inside looks like. We have a Nike check in there. And yeah, y'all, these are cute though. I'm feeling these. This is what the back of the, the kick looks like. Okay, it's not nothing too much going on with these, y'all. Just a pretty basic, you know, green. Loving this color. Okay. I believe Jemaya is going to take all of this right here off once she try them on for y'all. I am going to have her to put them on real quick. It does come with this little Nike. This little Nike symbol. Wait a minute, y'all. Or is this something else? looks like a this is what it wait a minute girl i don't know what this is <laughs> i thought it was some sort of like nike check or something like that but it got something else something else written on here which i don't know what it mean or what it says mm. but anyways i'm gonna go ahead and have jamaya to try these on so y'all can get a good look at how they look on her feet and i'll be back with my thoughts the pricing and that coupon code for y'all okay y'all keep on watching on Jemiah's feet now she did tell me that they were a little tad big just around here she got like you know some toe space or whatever but that's actually a good thing because she'll be able to grow into these now I don't know why their size difference has like changed in the number wise because I think I've been getting Jemiah a size 39 a EU 39 in the European sizes this is actually a, what size did I tell y'all this was? A 37.5, which is a women's six and a half. But then on another shoe site, they have a, um, a EU 39, 
which is uh, six and a half in women. So this shoe here though is running a little tab big, but like I said, y'all, she'll be able to grow into these and she'll have them a little longer because she got a little, you know, toe space or whatever. But I think they look cute on her feet. Now on the site, these are running $165, which is not bad. And I do got a coupon code for y'all. And it is CAN, C-A-N, and you will get an extra $15 off. So if y'all visit the site, I will drop down everything in the description box for you ladies and for you gents. If y'all want to visit their site, this is a legit site because I did get a couple of DMs um, actually asking me questions on if this was a legit site. And this is definitely a legit site. I actually reached out to the seller and he did tell me that um, they do have free shipping and that he do actually ship out his sneakers that anybody purchased from him. I'm giving y'all, you know, heads up on a lot of these sites that if y'all like to rock replicas, y'all are not afraid to wear a pair of dupes, you know. Hey, check out one of these sites and just hit them up and y'all can get y'all a pair of kicks that looks exactly the same as the real deal. Especially if y'all don't want to pay a buku's of money or some of y'all might can't even find these type of kicks like at Foot Locker, Lady Foot Locker, Finish Line. Y'all probably can't find these or any one of the other shoes that I have reviewed. So going on one of these sites and just getting them and knowing that the, the website is legit, you know, and you're paying like an affordable price for them, y'all. Y'all just can't beat that, y'all. I'm just saying, you just can't beat it, okay? So yeah, I just wanted to throw that out there though because I have been getting questions asked about you know, the companies that I have been reviewing and stuff like that. Just know this is a legit company right here. He has free shipping and you will get your kicks if you were to get on his site and order anything from him. Okay. And as y'all can see, this is some really, really nice quality. Okay. Very nice quality. You can't go wrong. They don't have a smell to them or nothing like that smells pretty fresh to me and i'm i'm loving these i'm so loving these y'all especially this color this color is off the chain okay so but anyway we're gonna jump back into the vlog you guys y'all just keep on rolling with your girl okay so i'm gonna see y'all on the other side all right y'all know what <laughs> i had to change the plans just that fast child leaving at the dollar uh tree parking lot i was just like no nah, let me go and make my way over here the reason being as soon as I get up in Walmart, y'all, they probably ain't got jack up in there, child. Cause every time I go up in there, they owls be looking very scary. And it look like they ain't hardly got nothing up in here either. So I'm actually gonna pick up some juice for Jamaya, some potato skins, and she asked me for some chicken strips, but she normally don't eat the chicken strips up in here. I would have to go to um I would have to go to Lit Junior somewhere and get those in a bag and they didn't change the whole size of they chicken strips y'all in Lit Junior child. And they only like four dollars and something for like a little a little medium sized bag. And I was wondering like why did they do that? Like why they downsized like this child? <laughs> yeah. But anyway. Let me make my way on down here. I just get some juice down here. I almost forgot about my review, child. <laughs> I just went ahead on and popped it in there real quick. <laughs> I was just like, dog, I forgot to tell him about the review. But yeah, let me finish doing my little grocery shop. Yeah. Around here real quick, y'all, to see if they have my apple cider vinegar peel. The um the brag. This is where I normally come and get them, which they do have some right here. So I'm gonna grab me a bottle of those and girl, them peels is how they normally $20. Yeah, the, the retail price is $21.99, but they got them on sale for $16.49 today. 
They just got this little sale going on, child, which I'm, I'm happy about that. <laughs> I'm very happy about it. Oh, I need to give me some, some vitamins too. Let me grab me some of these. And what else I need? I was trying to think about the rest of my food items that I wanted to pick up out here, but I didn't want to get too much because I know I'm going to Walmart still and they may have a couple of items up in there. So I may just grab this here and um, head to Walmart. I'm trying to see do they have any peppermint oil up in here too because y'all know about how Walmart is, child. Every time I look for peppermint oil, they don't hardly never have it. Never. Wait a minute, I'm just going back and forth. I'm trying to figure out what I want to be on. Hmm, maybe that is now. Let me see if I can find this peppermint oil. So I was out of luck with a peppermint oil because I still ain't found it yet, but I did run into the, um, the Eric plug-ins, y'all, and they got a sale on these today. So they're actually $10.99 today. They normally would be $11.29, but since they got a sale going on, I guess I'm gonna pick these up. I'm gonna continue to walk around and see if I can find this this peppermint oil, I thought it would be over here, but it's not, so I'm gonna keep on walking, child. Y'all, I forgot all about my chili, girl, that I'm gonna get ready to make. Y'all already know how I make my chili. So, if y'all wanna catch that, you know, you probably gotta head on over there to my vlog channel, because I know I made some chili once before over there. But, I am gonna make some chili soon due to you know, it's being fall, it's kind of cool outside, and you do got a taste for some chili. So I just got to pick up, I do got some tomato sauce and tomato paste and stuff like that at home already. I do got some pinto beans too that I throw in my chili. I don't do the kidney beans or the red beans, I just do pinto beans and I make my own homemade chili. But what I am looking for is, um, uh, what am I looking for, child? I'm looking for something. I don't even see it in here. I know I gotta pick up the chili package for the chili. Or do I got some of it at home already? Child, I don't even know. I have the slightest idea. Anyway, child, let me go and get what I'm gonna get so I can get up out of here. And y'all gonna catch me probably at St. okay? A cute tree right here that's real cute yes i see a lot of their little you know like christmas decor and stuff like that that you can sit outside or beside the tree look at these wreaths y'all yes sam's is putting all they stuff out they got it out i'm talking about toys everywhere <laughs> they got toys all all up there y'all right here Shabby, they got toys down every aisle. <laughs> okay, let me make my way on around here, pick up these paper plates and this uh, toilet paper. Wait a minute now, tricks, popcorn? What the world? Girl, they coming up with any and everything with fruity sweet glaze. Oh wow. Yeah, they coming up with any and everything, child. Twix. Popcorn, they going a little bit too far. I'm just saying. <laughs> All right, so here is the toilet paper. I think I'm gonna grab one of these. Right here. I guess the paper plates are on around here somewhere. Look like they to move some stuff around. Yeah, it's around here, chat. All right, so. I'm gonna go ahead and get the 250 counts. Uh, oh, them got a hole in it. Grab these right here. 
Sorry, y'all. I don't get the camera and everything, so. I'm gonna go around here and see what kind of chicken strips they got. I normally don't buy them from out of here. Like I told y'all, I get them from Lit Junior, but I just wanna see what kind they have. I may just grab some from out of here. Get all the pins, so what kind of get? Spanish artichoke bites. I don't think that's gonna be too good. Cheese stuffed mushrooms. Mmm. Oh, they got a lot of different stuff, y'all, that I would love to try. But then again, I'm like, <laughs> where did they come up with all this stuff? Spinach and cream cheese pastry with, what's that say, feta? Mmm, red hot original boneless chicken bites. I bet them pretty good. I haven't ran into no chicken. What is this? Honey butter, oh, them honey butter biscuits. Wait a minute. Them chicken breasts with a honey butter biscuit flavor. Chicken breasts. What the world? Now, child, listen. Y'all. I just wonder. These right here may be sweet. I don't know what they may taste like, but I would pick them up and try them, but I'm like, hmm. Nah, I just don't try to find Jamaya's song real quick. <laughs> Oh Lord, those are some boneless, oh, them boneless hot wings. These are some chicken tenders right here. The Tyson chicken tenders. Let's see. I really don't want to buy no chicken and she don't eat it because she's so dang on picky. And I know that the only kind at the moment that she eating y'all is the ones that I always pick up at Lick Junior's. These are chicken breasts. Oh, these are like chicken patties for a sandwich. And y'all already know where I'm rocking it when I buy those. All these. <laughs> well, well, well. Looks like your girl is out of luck with getting some chicken timbers over here. Yeah, I guess I'll just pass buying any from here y'all I would pick up these Tyson ones but let me see this whole bag for $17 these aren't the kind that Jamalia eat but I don't know what I need to do I probably just need to go right on to go share don't even worry about it baby yeah, I'm gonna go on around here though. Let's see what else they got over there in the little the little sweet section where the cakes and stuff get real quick. So y'all remember you buying them hot shrimp. I think they look like some um southern style hot shrimp that I bought from out of here the last time. Yeah, them things are so hot. <laughs> Jamaya and Louis told them I'm gonna grab these right here, then I'm gonna get another bomb food because they was good, but I'm gonna get the one that's not hot. These are just the regular shrimp right here. And they $13.98 a pound. But you know, they good though. They real good. Now the ones that that's all uh, that's real spicy and hot. Baby, I ate a couple of them things. I said, no, nah, I can't do these no more. <laughs> Just messing with my stomach, child. Uh -uh. <laughs> so I finally made it over here, y'all, where all of the desserts are. Let me walk over here first. What is this right here? These are some Halloween cake balls. Mmm. Is this a big old brownie or what? I think it is, child. A big old brownie. Oh, them muffins and stuff looks good. But your girl cannot have none of that. No, ma'am. Let's see. This is what I normally would pick up. I haven't had this in a long time, y'all. This is my granola that I normally would eat. These are some cinnamon rolls. I bet they good one. Let me see what else we got over here. That's cornbread. Oh, them cupcakes and stuff look so, so, so good. Oh my goodness, y'all. This stuff looks so good, girl. 
Mm, mm, mm. I think these are some dainty shoes. I got them in all different kinds of flavor. Cherry. This is apple. And I think that white was like cream cheese or something. This right here. Or it could be some sort of vanilla filling or something. This cake right here. I wonder what kind of cake this is. It's a lemon hen fit cake. Hen it or something. Honey or something, sure. I just know the cake is a lemon cake. These cupcakes look so good. What is this? Strawberry. These are some garment strawberry and lemon uh, cupcakes, y'all. Man, they look good, girl. They look so yummy. <laughs> they got all their pies out here. They know they ready for Thanksgiving. Ooh, but once November hit, like I told y'all, all this stuff right here probably be gone, girl. These people gonna come up in here and rack up on all these sweets for the holidays. And then Christmas is around the corner too. Oh yeah, baby. This whole entire section over here finna be scaped. <laughs> well, I thought I was finna pick up me some sweets or something. This is some peppermint bark, which I've never tried that and I don't think I ever wanna try it. Cause the, the, the word bark, they don't even sound right to me. They sound like it's gonna be nasty. This is some chocolate peanut butter fudge. Ooh, I bet that's sweet. <laughs> you know, y'all remember the old fashioned uh, fruit cake that looked like this? Yeah, granny, my granny used to tear this up right here. She used to stay having this in her kitchen around about Christmas time. I didn't too much care for it when she gave it to me. I was just like, mm-mm. It's all the stuff that was in it that did it for me, child. I was just like, no, nah, I can't eat this. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Woo! So this will be my last ad that I'm coming down, y'all. Well, actually, I thought the Dove soap was over here, but I'm gonna have to make my way over there to the next aisle over there because I don't see it. Well, yes, I do. Wait a minute. No, I don't. This deodorant. <laughs> make my way around. All righty, here we go. I gotta pick Jamaya up some soap. <sighs> I hate they don't have the kind that I'm looking for, though. So you're getting 16. I'm gonna get this right here. 16 bars for 17 books. Oh yeah, it's a little windy. The wind is is blowing like crazy out here right now. At first it was all right. But this wind is blowing. Girl, I got my hair all over me. Try to calm some of this stuff down. I'm finna make my way over here to Walmart. This is finna be my last little stop, y'all. And I'm gonna try to grab everything I need over here. Whew. All right. Let me give me one of these hand wipes. I did put some alcohol in my wipes this time. <laughs> Oh, they smell like purity alcohol. Yes, ma'am. I got some spray. Dog, I think I left my spray. My spray at home in my beauty room. But I did make me up like a little, a little concoction. <laughs> Is that what y'all call it? A little concoction. <laughs> I put some alcohol and just a couple of little drops of vitamin E. And that's my little, my little hand sanitizer spray that I use, you know, getting in and out of my car and stuff like that. I forgot the stuff at home, Chad. I go and put it in my purse. Oh, but I'm glad I got these wipes in my hand. My hand smells just like alcohol. Just what I want it to smell like, alcohol. I'm finna head over here though, y'all, to Wally World. So I'ma catch y'all as soon as I get over there and it's gonna be my last stop, okay?
Y'all yeah, already know what that Merlex for, baby. To keep your girl bowels flowing. <laughs> Came down here. Let's see if I can grab some Dow soap. I guess I'm gonna get one of these. And I'll grab one of these right here. smell too bad let me see i already know what this smell like this smell really good and do i want to get one more i may just keep those two y'all i'll just keep those two let me see if they got some peppermint oil child every time i come around here they don't never have them if i do see some girl i'm lucky i'm so lucky today so let's see. What is it? It's the bergamot. <laughs> this is lime. Looks like they ain't got no peppermint shine. Oh, Lord knows I need it. I really do need it. Came down this aisle real quick, y'all, to see if I can grab Jamai some more potato skins. So I didn't pick up her mini when I was at Kroger. They really didn't have too many up in there, so. Oh, Lord, they skates down here. Oh, Jesus. Let me see if they got. No, I don't even not see the the little Debbie's ice cream over here, child. Let me see. Okay, normally it would be over here. Well, they got a couple. I see the oatmeal pie, but I don't want to try this time. Mm, they got the Christmas. What? They put out the Christmas cake? I got to try this one, y'all. I got to try this one. This the Christmas cake, y'all. So it's probably just vanilla ice cream with the little Christmas sprinkles or whatever in here. That's probably what this is. I wonder. Hmm, but you know what, y'all? I don't like sprinkles. <laughs> I don't like sprinkles and stuff. I wonder if them little green sprinkles up in here. But you know, I would try this, but your girl just don't do sprinkles at all. Hmm. I may just try it though. I'll try it for y'all. I'll go and try it. I know I had to come over here real quick and try to find me some salad in a bag. Oh, these fruit look really good. Normally they don't be looking this fresh. Girl, I don't be knowing what be wrong, but that fruit be looking old. So that's the reason why I rarely pick it up anymore. But um, I think I need to pick up me one of these little Caesar salad bags. I had one at home, and girl, did I tear this salad up. Girl, this salad was so good. I'm gonna grab me another one, then I'm gonna get me a cucumber. Let's see, hopefully they got the cucumbers that, that I buy down here, because I stopped buying the regular ones. I normally will pick up those other ones, which I don't see any though. I don't think they got none, y'all. I should have picked it up when I was at Kroger, but I wasn't thinking about it. <laughs> I wasn't thinking about it at all, sure. Darn. I need to grab me some bananas. I don't see no bags nowhere. Oh, they look like good. These bananas. Feel like something wrong with them. Let's see. Guess I'll grab these. I got to find a bag. I'm just dropping stuff. Let me put this in my bag. I think I'm gonna grab me some fish sticks. Finally made it over here, child. And guess what? I don't see no potato skins over here at all. All I see is these cheese sticks. So, looks like Jamaya is out of look. Woo, she is definitely out of look. So y'all, they got the strawberry cheesecake baby bunt cakes. I already knew about this flavor. And I think the cinnamon swirl, but I think this strawberry is something new. These new too. 
These are Ding Dong Bouncers by Hostess. And then I got the Twinkie right here, the Twinkie kind with the glaze on it. Yeah. But, um, y'all yeah, finna get ready and get up out of here, child. I'm just trying to make my way. So here's the Christmas cake, little Debbie cakes right here, y'all. Yeah. yeah, so you girl gonna try that ice cream and see what it's tasting like. I don't know, but I see. It may just be good. <laughs> All right, y'all. I gotta pick up my Tide dish, not dish, laundry detergent. So I'll grab, I actually need to grab two of these. Grab two of these. I don't need any fabric softeners because I do have some already at home. I need some oven cleaner, so easy y'all. I'm gonna walk around here and see if they got some of that. And that's gonna be it. I forget I need some of this right here, child. <laughs> It up child i'm gonna get ready to get myself up out of here and head to the house because i gotta go get jamaya so let me do the self checkout because i know he's lying <laughs> eventually finally walked in the house y'all i got everything on the table and some stuff over there <sighs> i was gonna do a little haul but I know y'all probably saw everything I picked up when I was putting everything in the bag, you child. So I was like, I ain't gonna put this on the table and do no separate haul. I really don't need to. But for those that did skip over the video, I can just share just a little something, something I bought. I got this ice cream that I'm gonna put in the freezer because girl, you already melted. That fast. That fast. Okay. All right, so y'all already saw the majority of this stuff I picked up. I got some Caesar salad, some um, fish sticks. This is the stuff that I picked up at uh, Sam's, y'all. And your girl will be eating some of these today. Yes, ma'am. I know those things gonna be good. Well, I'm gonna get ready to end it, y'all. Cause like I said, I was gonna finish sharing everything that I picked up. Child, I got stuff all over the place. I picked up four of these, and I'm trying to share a little bit as I go. <laughs> oh, y'all! I'm all over. Cotton balls and all this stuff here came from the Dollar Tree. Okay. That's my little forks and stuff. Got Jamaya her dove. Soap. I got my two tights right here. And I'm kind of like pushing it too, y'all, because I got to go get Jamaya. This is my other tie. So I'm trying to hear up and just show you all just a little bit. So I can put this stuff up. Got some Clorox. I forgot about this stuff. I just picked up at uh, Dollar General. I hope this stuff here works pretty good. This is the Comet Kitchen Cleaner. Okay. I got this fabric softener. Some easy y'all. Got my Marilax. Plug ins. Okay. I need to take two of these right now. Apple cider vinegar, brags. And them things work pretty good, y'all. I was trying to, girl, when I saw these for 99 cents, I said, let me go and grab two of these when I was at Crow. <laughs> Cause they normally don't be 99 cents. The cream of chicken, and I know I put this in my dress. Girl, them normally be like a dollar and some. Or no, they done went up. Them things two dollars and some. Yeah. 
They sure have. They didn't actually went up. So to get up for 99 cents, I'm just like, you grab me two of them at least before they uh before they jack this price back up. Where am I finna stick these? I'm gonna stick these in the other deep freezer. I told my husband I want a black deep freezer for Christmas, y'all. <gasps> That's what I told him I wanted for Christmas this year. I said, husband, I want a black deep freezer because I'm not tired of this white one. This white one is just about, girl, it didn't just about had it. It ain't really getting froze at the bottom no more. And I just don't want it because I got to literally put some of my food over here in this freezer. And you know, this refrigerator freezer ain't that big. And I got a lot of stuff over here as it is, child. So I told you my husband, I said, I want a black deep freezer for Christmas, and that's all I told him I want. I ain't tell him nothing else. <laughs> I probably tell him I want a waffle maker too, because my waffle maker didn't come out on the girl. Girl, I was making some waffles. First, I cleaned it. And um, all of a sudden, I plugged it up, y'all. And then I, I made myself one waffle. So, you know, that was fine. But then when I put that second batter in there, child, I heard something was like, like it was shocking the back of the, uh, the back of the waffle maker. I was just like, please don't let this thing be the comp that on me. Child, come to find out. <laughs> I literally opened up my waffle maker and the thing was barely cooked and the heat started going down on it. I was just like, oh well, I might as well just go on toss this one cause it looks like it been comped out on me. So, I may just tell my husband I want a new waffle maker too, child, because I be making my own waffles now, because they just taste way better than the store-bought ones. And I used to buy the store-bought ones all the time, but I stopped buying them. I think the last time I bought them, well, actually, no, I actually bought some. Let me see if I still got some in the freezer, child. I actually bought some because I only eat the thick Eggo waffles. Them the only ones I, know, I uh, rarely eat. These right here. Girl. That was the last box. Right there. I haven't bought no more waffles. That was it. Because the girl been making her some homemade waffles lately. <laughs> so I need to get my waffle maker back. I sure do. But anyway, let me finish up, y'all, because I don't have a lot of time and I cannot hold this camera and get to it like I want to. So, I hope y'all enjoy hanging out with your girl for a couple of hours. <laughs> and uh, I'll be back with more videos, y'all. Y'all just stay tuned. Your girl got some more reviews to throw out for y'all. Okay, so I'm going to see y'all next time. Y'all be blessed. Y'all stay safe out there. And your girl going to holler back. All right. Mwah. Later, babe.